I woke up slowly and saw Junko sleeping peacefully. I smiled at myself as I touched his cheeks. Wow, he's so cute, my bunny. Suddenly, I felt his moving, so I quickly took my hands from him. He woke up and went straight to shower. Jung Kook, my husband. No, my cold husband. Our marriage was arranged marriage. I first thought we will not work out as we both different from each other. As I was friendly and he was cold, but slowly as days passed, I started to fell for him. I don't know, it just happened. I don't know if he feel the same as he is always cold and always working but he always care for me which make me feel for him deeply. I must get ready soon. I thought to myself and got ready and went down as Jankot must be waiting for me. As I came down, I saw Jungkook eating. I joined him and started to eat. As I was eating, suddenly Jungkook was looking at me. Jungkook, is there something on my face? You are so beautiful. What? You blushed and he smiled at you. Why and as days passed, you are becoming more and more beautiful. You are cute, kind and you are just perfect. I love you. I love you too. You said blushing as he leaned closer to kiss you as you closed your eyes to lead closer to him. To kiss. Suddenly someone tapped my shoulder. I opened my eyes to see Jungkook looking at me confused while eating. So it was a dream. Why N? Any problem? You shake your head as no and started to eat feeling embarrassed. Why N? You are an idiot. Every time you dream of Jungkook in night but you are started to daydream. Jungkook, what you have done to me? Why and be ready at evening. I will come to pick you. You nodded exactly. <coughs> you smiled as today there's a party at Jungkook office. We rarely go out so going to the party with him. I'm so excited and happy as you continue eating. You got ready for the party and Jungkook picked you up and you both arrived at a party. The party was so grand, the crowd was huge. As we were inside, two men approached us as dealers of Jungkook company. As I don't really understand their work as I was looking around curiously. As we were above to talk, suddenly a lady came towards us. She's Mia. Security of Jungkook. She excused herself with Jungkook, leaving me alone. <coughs> I was looking at both of them. His security was basically cringing on him as excuse of work. As I was so burning in stray seeing them, I didn't see someone took my hand. Hi beautiful, can we dance? He said as he leaned closer. No, you said straight forward. I don't take no to my answer, so let's dance, he said as he forced you suddenly. She said no, right? Why are you forcing her? He said as he took your hand from that man. Who the hell are you? I am a husband, he said as he punched that man and he ran away. You were 
was shocked and wanted to leave the party and junko got to know as he saw your restless so he took you home i am a husband you continue to repeat the words currently at night junko is sleeping next to me and you can't sleep remembering how junko protected you I was so happily thinking suddenly his phone vibrated so I took to turn off it as I took his phone I was shocked to see the message I saw the message from a security nya it says I love you too then I started to check previous messages and was even more shocked to see Young cook I love you Nia I love you too I wanted to cry so badly but I controlled myself but tears dropped from my eyes I kept back his phone and turned to the opposite of the bed and slept crying Next morning I woke up slowly and find Jungkook was not here. I slowly got up as my eyes was puffy. Lack of sleep. Why and you can do it. <clears throat> as each minute passed, I started to prepare myself to talk to Jungkook. When he arrived home at evening, I will talk to him. I will do it. I arrived home and the whole house was dark. I went towards to switch and turn on the switch light and turn to see the whole house was beautiful decorated. I turned to see Yan standing wearing a beautiful dress. I went towards her as I was about to ask she stopped me. now only i will talk jung kook when we got married i slowly fell for you but couldn't tell you as i was frightened will you feel the same as me but now it is necessary i love you jung kook your happiness is my happiness i love you so much that i will do anything for your happiness let's separate jung kook you must have tell me once you love me and then i could leave you for your happiness but you cheated on me with her your messages with her i don't know what to say more i'm so mad angry but love you so much so it's better to us to separate i only want your happiness you said while taking the suitcase i did this decoration to convince my feeling for last time before leaving the house forever you said and was about to leave but suddenly someone back hugged me never say you will leave me he said as he back hugged you tightly crying on your shoulder jung kook leave you in a relationship trust is more important thing but you broke my trust you don't love me relationship can't be forced so it's better to separate I never cheated on you Yan he said and he turned towards him confused What does he mean he never cheated on me before I could ask anything Nia with a man entered the house smilingly happily Yan Jung Kook never cheated on you in fact I'm only married and pregnant with Jay Me and Jungkook just act the rest Jungkook will explain. Why and I prevent to be cheating on you to test your love for me as you know my past love. I have trust issues. I'm so sorry why and I broke your trust for me.
when we got married we were different but as days pass i started to fell for you for your kindness for your love but i have trust issues so i test you i am so idiot i must have not test you you were hard broken i i broke your trust for me i am so sorry wayan i am so sorry i don't know what to say jungkook i know you have trust issues but preventing cheating on me I just can't accept it. I just can't. Yes, Wayan, I can understand you. I must have not test you. I broke your trust. Please forgive me. I will never test you again. I'm so sorry. Okay, but never do this again. I love you. Never. I love you too. We both kissed. Let's go for a long drive. You nodded. You go and wait. I will bring my phone which I left on our bedroom. He nodded and left. You all must be wondering why I forgive Jungkook easily. In fact, I already know he is preventing to be cheating on me. I heard before when he was talking to Mia about preventing. I let it be as I wanted to know true feeling of Jungkook for me but I was angry when he tested me so I to prevent you said and left taking your phone